morning. I'm talking to Matt Burgle, who's Product Line Director of the Vision Jet at Cirrus Aircraft uh, this morning. How are you doing, Matt? I'm doing great, Ian. Thanks for having me. Hey, it's an absolute pleasure. I, I hear there's some exciting news around the, the Vision Jet. Absolutely. We're going to be introducing the next evolution of the Vision Jet, and we're going to be introducing the G2 Plus. The Plus is a new thing. The Plus is a new thing, and we'll be introducing uh, two key new capabilities to the airplane. One is we'll be increasing the overall takeoff performance of the aircraft, which what that really means is it's between a 4% increase if you're at sea level standard conditions, all the way to a 20% increase of takeoff performance if you're at higher uh, temperatures, higher altitudes, so overall high de higher density altitude airports. So you're getting more takeoff power when you need it the most. And what does that translate to in terms of runway length? So. For example, you can pretty much take off from any uh, about 1,200 meter runway um, yeah, during the hot summer months and really don't, don't have to worry about it. I mean, it, you can go fully loaded and you'll be able to take off from those, those runways you know, when, when they're about at, at sea level. Um, what that also means, if you uh, look at kind of your higher density altitude air, airports, it means you can take off with more weight or more fuel especially when you get those shorter runways and it's a, when you get those, those hotter months. Um, for example, um, in Las Vegas here in the United States, when, when, it, when you get to the summer months, it, it's 100 and 106 degrees Fahrenheit, 40 degrees Celsius wise. And it is, um, you're only able to take off from maybe with like 5,500 pounds from, from Henderson, Las Vegas. You're now able to take off fully loaded which includes about 500 pounds of extra fuel or 500 pounds of extra payload. So you're, you're taking off with more, you're increasing your, your range, you're really overall take, increasing the capabilities of the airplane. How, how, how does it work? Have you made the wings bigger? Have you made the engine more powerful? Have you? So we work with Williams International and um, just after further analysis, um, after further kind of taking a look at kind of how, what the engine capabilities are, we were able to uh, uh, modify the FADEX software so we're able to get more power during the takeoff position uh, when the thrust level is in the takeoff position. So really when you need it the most. And we're able to do that without uh, increasing TBO times, without um, really, I mean, overall, we're able to do that with, uh, with, with the FADEC change in the engine. Okay, and so but presumably like the um, MCT max continuous thrust level will remain the same uh, in the cruise. That is correct. So uh, when you when you pull the power back to MCT, um, the, uh, the engine will be forming just like our current G2 airplane. Right. Yeah, when we introduced the G2, we introduced more capabilities with uh, increased altitudes. Uh, we uh, decreased the noise in the cabin. Uh, we introduced the auto throttle and the perspective uh, touch plus uh, avionics. So yeah, G2 was a pretty big um, um, evolution of the Vision Jet product line and the G2 plus is uh, with this enhanced uh, takeoff uh, capabilities, especially in those um, uh, what we call hot and high conditions. So in order to get the plus to your G2, you need to buy a G2 plus or can you can you buy a plus and add it to your G2? So uh, starting with um, deliveries in the end of August, um, all the aircraft coming off the production line will be G2 plus airplanes, uh, vision jets. Um, there is going to be an opportunity for customers who are in G2 airplanes to get um, the ability to upgrade um, to a G2 plus or with those capabilities um, probably coming in 2022. And there'll be more, more to that here, pricing and timing uh, coming up in the near future. And talk, talking of pricing, have you released the pricing for the G2 plus? Uh, yes, we have. So now a fully loaded airplane will be uh, coming out the door uh, at about a $2.93 million. Okay. And, and is there a waiting list these days for G2 plus? Because I'm impatient, clearly. Yep, we do have um, a, we do have a um, a wait list of about uh, I shouldn't say a wait list, but we do have about 380 people who are currently uh, um, have interest in the Vision Jet and have deposits down for a Vision Jet. Um, with that being said, um, we do have delivery options open. You know, kind of probably within about a year time frame. When you look at demo airplanes and uh, and just uh, as and customers who maybe no longer have Vision Jets, you know, as part of their uh, 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 owner aircraft ownership um, uh, needs. We we do have um, so there is options available as well. So we do have 380 people waiting, but but if a Vision Jet is something that you need a uh, need quickly, talk to Cirrus Aircraft and we'll we'll figure out a solution.
I'll figure out a solution. Good. I'm, it's just the 2.93 million that I need quickly. So if you can help me with that. We do finance. <laughs> oh, there you go. I'll take two. Um, are, are there any other things that come with the plus aside the uh, engine performance? Yeah, and uh, we are also introducing in-flight Wi-Fi as well on, on the, the G2 Plus. And um, so we're utilizing the GoGo L3 advanced system. Um, right now, their network is uh, pretty much in the United States and um, Southern Canada. And, uh, but we are introducing that capabilities, which gives our customers about uh, 3G uh, type speeds. You're able to um, do emails uh, with attachments. You're able to do messaging. Um, you're able to uh, do browsing. I mean, no, no problem. Be able to use all your applications on your phone. Um, probably the only real limitation is it's just you're not able to stream uh, a video, for example. Well, unfortunately, as you know, I'm, I'm not able to get over to the US at the moment, thank you, because of the various travel restrictions. So, uh, but I will get over there as soon as I can. And hopefully when I do, we can meet up and, and, and go flying in the, in the G2 Plus. Absolutely. Looking forward to it. Thanks very much for joining us, Matt, and uh, I hope you have a great Oshkosh. Thanks, Ian. I appreciate it. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed that, please give us a like, leave a comment, and subscribe.